Good morning everybody and welcome back to another adventure and this morning it is a cold and chilly frosty morning in the Scottish borders. It is now 6.20 in the morning and I am driving to my sunrise location this morning. Uh, today I'm going to Rubers Law, uh, which is an iconic hill in the area where I live. It's a, an extinct volcano. I'm going to meet a friend Callum there and we're going to go for a hike for sunrise. At the moment conditions are looking pretty good. I can see some stars and I can also see some clouds. So let's see what we get. It's going to be pretty dark on the hike up there so I'm not going to film too much. But when we get to the top and it gets light, hopefully I'll have some amazing stuff to show you. On we go. Well, we have reached the summit and now we've dropped back down a little bit to, fi uh, to find a nice composition. It's probably too dark to show you what's going on at the moment, but the clouds, as you can see, are starting to catch some beautiful light and we're still a good 45 minutes away from sunrise here. I'm just trying to find somewhere where I can maybe shoot in both directions because if it kicks off massively on this side, then I really want to be able to get a nice shot going this way as well. What an absolutely beautiful morning. This could be, this could be a belter. Okay, now that it's a little bit lighter, we've had a good chance to scout this side of Ruber's Law to see what's going on. And Carlam's found a nice little spot over there. Not too ashamed to admit it, but he's found a better composition over there than I have over here. Uh, oh, I'm gonna duck under the one tree, which is up here. Um, so I'm going to grab my bag, I'm going to head back over that side. I'm still going to be shooting the same feature, which is, which is this little peak behind me here. But I'm going to shoot it from a different angle and the wall creates a far nicer leading line into the shot. And if I want to, I can turn around and shoot towards sunrise. Magic. Let's go back over that side now. So this is the spot which Callum has found, so we can shoot this way towards sunrise and use this wall as a nice leading line. And then the other composition, which is over here, is an improvement on the shot which I had looked at over there. We can now use this wall which runs beautifully down into this peak here. So two compositions, both right next to each other. And now we'll wait another half an hour and see what happens. I'm gonna get set up now and try and fine tune these compositions. Mr. Finley sporting a fantastic Movember moustache, although he's actually had it for about the last eight months. Okay, just to explain this shot to you just now, what I've gone for is I'm using this zigzag here, as I spoke about before, which leads you into this tree. Beautiful sky, which has been kicking off. Sun is gonna rise just on the left-hand side of my frame here. Um, I've done maybe bracketing three or four different exposures. One to capture the highlights in the sky, then get the mid-ground, and then I've got a nice brighter exposure to capture the foreground. I think what we'll do is keep shooting here until the sun pops up, and then I'm gonna head over and get this other composition. So uh, the sun is now starting to come up and the sky is starting to go on fire. So there's a good chance we're heading into what we call headless chicken time, which is means we're going to be running around like headless chicken trying to get these images. But look at this sky behind us. It's all kicking off now. I'm going to probably put you down on the wall over here and try and um, concentrate on some photography.
So you saw we were like headless chickens there. So the sun did rise behind us and started to light up this composition beautifully. So we quickly turned around and we were shooting, but now the sun's gone. Um, what we really were relying on at the moment is the sun lighting up this wall, hitting the side of the hill here. So hang around for another five minutes or so and see if it pops back up again. But the sky shooting this way was incredible. So I think we definitely got a nice shot this morning. What do you think Callum got on? I think so. Callum's happy. Okay, fingers crossed this sun pops back out again. Um, yeah, because this is a nice shot as well. Well, luckily the sun did come back out and I was able to fire off this second composition. I'm interested to know which of these two photographs was your favourite, so please drop down into the comments section and let me know there. Thank you again for all your continued support. Okay, that's us signing off from this morning. Callum is halfway down the hill. I hope you enjoyed the shots this morning and I'll see you on the next one. <laughs>